please subscribe to Sailing Gypsy Christine on YouTube for everything sailing, the lifestyle, and travel, the realities of the sailing lifestyle, food, cooking, scuba diving, spear fishing, all the shit that we do. Please subscribe to Sailing Gypsy Christine. Please subscribe. Thank you. We're going to Morea. Say hi. Hello. What's your Hello. name? Christine. Oh, sorry. Puratu. Puratu. Yeah. And we're going to Morea. Well, we're supposed to go camping, but I don't think we're going to camp much. Yeah, no, it's raining. It's and it's raining. raining. Do you see the background? Beautiful. And I have lots of bourbon and gin. Oh, see, That's she's it. already started. Yeah. Taking the ferry to Morea. So we're moving. Look at the mountains. It's very cloudy lately. Lots of rain. This is Puritu. That means beautiful in Tahitian. So I learned a new word. Puritu. Is drinking illegal on the ferry. She's not supposed to. Yeah, she's breaking the law. <laughs> I have um, gin and bourbon, but I'm going to save that for later. So, uh, Maria is coming up. See the island? See the island as well. Uh, Maria. It's very windy. It's very windy. Photo op. Bungalows. Look at the water. Very pretty. The Sofitel Hotel. Pretty water, bungalows. This little jetty. The water's gorgeous. At least it stopped raining. Buffet area. Sofitel Hotel. Kayak with flowers. Gorgeous. Cloudy today, but at least it stopped raining. So I'll come back to hang out with my friend. She works here.
We're going to Morea. Morea. Look at the water. It's gorgeous. And um, yay! The sun is out. After raining nonstop for like five days. Look at my tattoos. I love them. Look at the. Um, that's Papite. I'm in Morea. Beach bungalows. We're just gonna hang out at the beach all day because my butt hurts. I'm sore. I'm not used to biking. I think we did 20 kilometers or 18 around the island. 16. 16? So I did 16 kilometers. So that's like about eight miles. Maybe a little bit more. So I think I just need to rest for a few days. I can't walk because I have blisters. I'm just a mess. I guess turning 40, I'm breaking down. So, background. Look at the water. My feet. Oh, ouch. So we're gonna try to go well watching, uh, well swimming. And um, Celine knows a local, so we're gonna see what kind of bargain we can get. I have bourbon to trade. And um, alcohol here is so expensive, I think we can get it for free with beer or bourbon. And I can swim with whales, one of my dreams. It's for my um, so what do you have in your female purse? I have some medicine. Mm -hmm. This one for sick. This one uh, when I have pain in my belly during my period. Cramps. This one when I'm getting crazy at work and I have a so strong headache. And oh, something else for headache. I have many headaches with work. Some hair plot. Wow. To sleep well. She has a lot of and stuff. Oh, the most important Something thing for she's for a boulder. In yes, my hair. tweezers, and I need to clip That's my nails at least every two weeks. And I pluck when I have time on a passage. I just pluck all my hair. It's very soothing. It's like you do video. I'm with Celine. She's a photographer. I'm marketing her. But today we're just gonna hang out and do nothing. And I look hungover and topless. But I'm grooming myself. <laughs> no, people like to hear shit like that. Herbiscus floating in Morea. Look at the water. Bungalows. Look at the view. The beach. We're just hanging out. Um, Celine. Look at that. Gorgeous. So today I'm not doing anything. I'm just gonna rest. I look like a hungover whore. But that's okay. And Celine said that um, girls were making fun of me at the supermarket. But fuck them. <laughs> <laughs> Celine? Oh, no, just a picture. Okay, wait. Celine takes. This is marketing, it's a commercial. We'll do more later. She takes great photos of romantic pictures, beach pictures, anything you want. At the Sofitel <laughs> Hotel, at this beach, you wear a beautiful dress. And she's an expert at lighting because she took pictures of me and everybody loves them. So, we're gonna do underwater video. Okay, go down. <laughs> and you gotta swim towards me. I don't know if I got it because I didn't do it. It's an awesome video. And it's not super sunny, but at least it's not fucking raining for four fucking days. Ooh, look at the water. You see my feet. That's underwater. I love my underwater camera. I finally...
look really horrible because when I'm hungover, I look like a cheap whore, but that's okay. Ooh, so clear, you can see my shadow. So what I'm doing in the water is I'm peeing. I'm not gonna show that, of course. Um, I have a hard time peeing in cold water. I don't know, it's like weird. I have to like concentrate a lot. I don't know if people have that problem. So, yeah? Oh, to the car? Yeah. I'll go with you. No, but what, is it dangerous? So I'm here at the beach, close to the Sofitel Hotel. And the water is gorgeous. And yeah, I look really hungover. I see lots of wrinkles today, but fuck it, who cares. Um, so YouTube, oh I can't even speak. YouTube videos. I'm just doing selfies. What an amazing life I have. Um, actually, I should use my GoPro stick, but um, I'm too lazy. I do not like technology. So, I'll just do selfies. At first, I didn't want to do... Uh, oh, it's sunny. I didn't want to do um, nude videos, but fuck it. I'm nude all the time anyway, so it's fun. Well, maybe topless and light nudity. But, but look it, I'm bloated. I've been drinking too much beer and alcohol. So this is very nice. I'm trying to get rid of ah, tan lines for my photo shoot Wednesday and later in the week. Celine's gonna take pictures of me again in Morea. And she did the amazing shots last time. And I found out she doesn't even have a good camera. She's just very good at composition. Hang Lu and Gypsy Hobo. So that's why if you see these two channels, it's me, Christine. So my name is Christine and you'll probably see the Gypsy Christine in front of it because it's just easier to make people remember the name. But Gypsy Christine, I'm combining my names and it's me. I've been traveling this way for maybe 12 years. I think maybe 13 years. I can't remember. As Gypsies go and Hobos go, that's my channel. Please subscribe and thank you. It's a hilo. We call it we call it hilo. Uh, we call it hilo. Uh, yeah. Are you gonna so, sing and do massage? Sing and dance. Oh wait, that's unga unga unga. Yeah, uh, because uh, there, there are there are uh, Swedish uh, Thai yes. Thai massage yes. and uh, uh, in in the list of massage uh, we have uh, it. Uh, it's a uh, thing called a deep tissue massage. Oh, deep tissue. It's a pinching of a deep tissue. Yes. Yeah, but the main tissue. Yeah. But uh, we, we call it uh, in our dialect Hilo. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, because uh, Hilo can, uh, can, uh, can easily be uh, restored yeah. straight yeah. on. Yeah. This location of the yeah. we can do that. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
it's a, it's, 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 it's really uh, It's two o'clock, please. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Singapore is going to be a lot of money down and up from Michael Ray. In SRA Hot Springs, in the Philippines. I don't even know what this is showing. Whoa. So my poor Wi-Fi connection, there's prawns, pork chops, oh, little prawns and sticks, um, pork belly I think, chicken, pork belly, squid and fish. What kind of fish is this? Um, it's lifty. It's lifting. Yes. I don't, I don't know what's the real name. <laughs> okay. So we're not hungry yet, but we're still deciding. And Rocks Rocks here is tied up. Oh no, I want to escape. But yummy food. But there's also a pot roast that looks really good. So, like, is she so beautiful? Stunning. Ah! Hey Janet, you're gonna dance with me. Let's take a Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Gypsy Hobo at the Hot Springs in Rawlin, Taiwan. Let me show you around. Yay! Success for Rawlin, Taiwan Hot Springs. It's sort of um, misty in here. Look at they have all this stuff. That one I heard super hot. The Hot Springs! Yay! Gypsy Hobo, you never know where I'm going to end up. Um, hot Springs, Rawlin, Taiwan. It's smoky, like a sauna in here. Natural Hot Springs. Join me on Gypsy Hobo. Thanks for watching.
my tea's ready. I'm gonna drink it outside. I've been meaning to um, motivate myself to go kayaking, so maybe today I'll do that. Morning tea. The view of the mountains. So it gets really hot full of flies and mosquitoes. My Rox Rox loves it here. She has friends. She runs around wild and she comes back. My Rox Rox. Mama, who are you talking to? Mama. So I'm going to put the juice in the freezer. Look it, Roxy just climbed on top of me. She's trying to get my attention. Oh, I think she wants to come out. There goes my rocks, rocks to get her. Oh, usually she um, sprints across. Maybe I'll do a spy on Roxy day. She knows I'm talking about her. She jumps to the other boat. There she goes. And then she rocks through the plank. She's actually much better than I am. She knows I'm following her. Off she goes. Hi, T. Look at uh, my friend came yesterday. Look at all these flies. Sometimes there's like 20 of them in here, and I just. And she killed three. I need to pick them up and throw them out, but that just shows how many flies. And they buzz around like crazy. And I try to just keep the screen doors shut and the doors shut, but it just gets so hot. There's like flies on the floor. See, I've killed many flies. So I need to just see fly right there. See, they just like spawn. Rocks, rocks, follow me up here. So this is Zeke's bar or clubhouse. My boat is towards the back. to do videos and talking to myself. I'll show you a very nice view. And at least as a book change, I've even been lazy where I stopped reading books, which sort of means I'm sort of down and depressed. So there's the view. At the moment, my life is pretty boring. So I'm up at the clubhouse. This is where a lot of the cruisers, sailors, um, go for happy hour. Or just for drinks after a um, work day. I come up here to plug in and to try to um, work on my book. So today, I'm just going to sit here and try to do that. And I come upstairs also to use the toilet. So I guess I'll do that now before I um, sit down and start writing. So I think today I'm going to write about how Angie and Christine meets in my book based on our characters but a fictional premise of course. So motivation. Think motivation.
this is the Hollywood and we're just looking at the name. Oh, there's no name right here. Huh? Oh yeah! Dave says, do we have a marker pen? We can put our names. No, I don't. Oh, the pizza looks good, but we're not, we're not eating American food. So I'm gonna get my two tattoos retouched and get another one for my brother. And Melrose. Somewhere. I mean, you know, mostly. So I'm getting my tattoo refreshed, um, brighter. So this is Eric, the tattoo artist. <laughs> so Eric is working on my tattoo and it, and it hurts. Ooh, so much brighter and prettier. It doesn't look fucked up as much um, as last time. It's very nice actually. Ooh, very bright. So, yay. So I'll come back for my um, four leaf clover. <laughs> it hurts too much. I'm a very lazy vi video person and on YouTube I'm super busy currently I'm in the Philippines very slow Wi-Fi it took me maybe three minutes oh uh, no a seven minute video took me three hours to upload on Vimeo and YouTube so this is me here and now but a lot of the videos you will be seeing is backlogged since Australia, which is maybe three years ago. So I'm maybe two and a half, three years behind. So that's why it, it looks confusing, but if you look at the time frame, I was in Australia three years ago. Then we went to Indonesia. We sailed to Indonesia. We spent six months there. And then Paul and I sailed to the Philippines. And we just completed one season in the Philippines and we plan on staying another season because it's a great country they speak English it's cheap because we're on a limited budget so hopefully um, my helper can catch up with a lot of the videos and um, do current videos so now we have more of a plan on me sending him more current information so this is going to be confusing for you guys. So it's going to be like back, forth, back, forth, um, past, future, oh, present, past, present. So hopefully you guys can keep up and it's sort of like a mind game. So that's where I'm at. I'm a gypsy hobo. So I'm unplanned, unorganized, but hopefully we get more videos out. And thank you for watching. Visiting my mom's grave. We are, we always get lost, but we know to look for that dog. But I think it's a lamb, and that's where the grave is over here. They just cleaned up. So, going with my two aunts, and my mom's older older sisters, and she's the youngest. Also, my uncle is buried here, and um, my cousin's um, baby. But it's. A little bit off from here okay we always get lost we don't know where the graves are but it's by the dog there's the car so it should be around here so it, and my aunt's going way too far let's see that little lamb dog we were right we were just roaming we couldn't find it I had to go to the office to ask so they um, escorted us back here we're very close so this tree with flowers and I was going around and around it and we found it. Here it is. My grandmother found the way and my mom and my uncle has a huge one. He likes to play the piano. So now my aunt, we're going to put flowers and um, it's by this tree. And I was going by the tree too earlier but didn't find it. Found my uncle's grave. My grandmother is next to my mom. We decorated it.
Coral at five. Coral. Yes. Chloe at 12. Look at that maniac. She looks like a spider. Strange children. Follow me on Gypsy Hobo on YouTube to see where my traveling feet takes me. So come join me for all the crazy budget ways you can save money to travel the drunken whore way. Thanks for watching.